Sean DeTori investigates. Walsh's name came up as a suspect in Pam's murder. Her family and friends said they weren't surprised. Investigators found a clue first thought to be insignificant. In Walsh's truck, police found a candy wrapper. The same candy was found in Pam Sweeney's kitchen. This guy, while he was there, was calm enough actually to take one of those bags of candy out of the drawer and eat it. Walsh is a psychopath. The evidence suggests Walsh stayed long enough to have a can of soda and grab a piece of candy. But this was inconsistent with Walsh's story. He said after he found Pam's body, he called police, then ran outside to his car to try to get help. If this were true, would he have stopped on his way out of the house to grab a piece of candy? She told friends that Walsh asked her out on numerous occasions and wouldn't take no for an answer. He also stopped by her home unannounced and performed various household chores without being asked in an attempt to win her affections. Walsh was allegedly involved in eight assault cases with other women and was a suspect in a previous murder. Walsh hadn't broken the law and there was nothing they could do. But Walsh's clothing held a possible clue Walsh, in a panic, attempting to leave the scene of this uh, killing, got in his pickup truck, miscalculated the driveway, and drove into the ditch. It's now 3 o'clock in the morning. He just murdered a young woman, and his pickup truck is hopelessly stuck in a ditch. What do you do? Is it too early to fish sandwich? The evidence suggests Walsh entered Pam's home around 11 PM, but she must have heard someone inside and made her way to the hallway. Hey, brother. Where she confronted Walsh. Perhaps the most bizarre incident in the case was that Walsh's car was stuck in a ditch next to Pam's driveway. Walsh said he accidentally drove into the ditch when going for help. Walsh was found guilty and sentenced to life in prison. What I hear, what's happening to him once in a while in prison, I think he's probably got a harder time right now being alive than being dead. People think that the FBI doesn't have a sense of humor, but I think this proves that we do. Paint your bald spot. Power out.